Hey everyone, so today I wanted to talk about my um, spring fashion favorites, kind of like what's inspiring my fashion choices lately and um, yeah I just kind of wanted to get into it. So this is a collaboration with Makeup with Lisa I. If you haven't checked out her channel yet like go do it. Um, you can pause this video, check out her channel, come back. She's great and um, yeah she's just she's so nice, she's so happy and she does a lot of like she's very like fashion forward. <laughs> um, she you know she works at um, a high-end department store and you know she used to work at Charming Charlie she might still work at Charming Charlie I forget but um yeah she just she knows fashion she knows what she's talking about and um she always makes like cute outfit choices I'm sorry for the Windex back there but it needs to go somewhere why not back there and for that cup that just fell on the floor we're gonna leave it there this is actually a Ziploc container filled with uh, word poetry magnets. So you're gonna see some word poetry like in the background sometimes I think. Um, you probably won't be able to read any of it but it's for my own fun and my own little like Easter egg type things. Um, yeah but this this is just my life right now. And, um, so yeah um, you know it's not always this messy but sometimes it is. There's usually something in the background. Oh look some older receipt there. I better put that there. Got some cotton rounds that we're just gonna get right into the fashion. So let's start out with what I'm wearing now. So I have this seashell necklace on and I don't know if it really goes that well with like you know I don't think I necessarily need like a necklace with this like design on my shirt. You can get into the shirt too. But um yeah the necklace is just like a sand dollar. I think this is fun for uh, spring and summer. You know, I live like by the Jersey Shore, so well, I like a lot of beachy jewelry. I see a lot of it everywhere. Um, this has like a really cool detailing like right here on the clasp. I just hauled this in a, um, you know, like a small town um, craft show uh, haul that I did. Um, I forgot, I just found the business card too, and it was like the most gorgeous business card I think I've ever seen. It had like a little pearl on it. It was shaped like a wave. It was like the most detailed business card you could ever see, I think. And that was just really pretty, and like I forget what the company, what the brand's name is. I'll try to put it here if I can find it, but yeah, that was just like a really nice business card, and I need to look up like where else they're gonna be, because like if they're gonna be at anything local, I'll definitely have to check it out, because they had some really cool stuff. But yeah, like finds like this, um, sand dollars I always think are like lucky, even though I, I had a sand dollar one time that I found on the beach, and then like after that I did maybe the stupidest thing I've ever done in my life and then um can't go into details on that but I kind of like basically I sent a message in the wrong group chat and it was really bad and um yeah so and then I spilled nail polish on that sand dollar so like I originally got it I'm like oh this is my lucky sand dollar and then like literally two bad things happened with it but I'm like you know what people make mistakes it's still lucky sand dollar. It's still a sand dollar and I always think of that. So I just, I kind of like the sand dollar necklace for that. And um, yeah, um, these earrings too, I just got at that craft show. And these are definitely like my filming earrings of choice now. You know, you guys know I'm getting into like the Marvel movies and stuff. I feel like this makes me look like I'm some sort of superhero or something. I don't know why. It just kind of does and I like it. Um, and yeah, the shirt too kind of makes me feel like a superhero or a supervillain. I could go either way. <laughs> but yeah, um, I think that this is really nice. It's like really like long and flowy at the bottom. And it's not necessarily like the the most springy thing, but because it's like a nice neutral like black color. It's a nice neutral black color. It's nice and neutral. I think it goes with a lot of stuff. And if you put like colorful eye makeup or like a colorful jacket or something with it, it'll pop a little bit more. So speaking of jackets, let's get into the colorful jacket department. <laughs> Sorry, I keep like, I'm editing this out like when I'm filming it, but I keep moving um, the stand that I have this camera, this computer on. I'm doing this on a webcam because I'm grabbing for the stuff that I'm reaching for. But uh, yeah, anyway, you guys, if you watch my channel, um, you know that I really like these um, cardigans. These are long cardigans. It's from LuLaRoe, which is a brand that um, you've probably heard of. They 
sell on Facebook. It's like individual sellers, kind of like how Avon works, but with clothes. Um, these are called the the Sarah cardigans, and these ones people have named the Mermaid Sarahs because like they're nice and long, and they look kind of like bubbly. And you feel like you have a mermaid tail when you have them on. And they're just really pretty. So I, I have this blue colored one, which is actually the second one that I bought. And it was because I just, I wore this one so much. This is a pink one. I can't get the other sleeve on right now. Um, but I wear this pink one so much that I'm like, I need this in like every color. So anytime I see it on sale, I kind of grab a new color. Um, I've seen a couple on sale. I'm trying not to buy those just yet but um yeah I've been wearing both of these like a whole lot they make me feel like a mermaid Ooh, this one's inside out um <laughs> they make me feel like a mermaid it's a really nice like light material so like even on hotter days this feels nice um you know it's not too sweaty it doesn't make you too sweaty or too hot or anything and um it's just it's kind of just right for like a nice long like spring cardigan so yeah I love both of these um you know, they don't go with everything, but they go with a lot of things that I have. So like, yeah. Um, oh, I forgot my pink pants. I have like a couple pairs of pink pants. So these are not like an exact match for this, but I like to wear those with this and with something like this black top, I think it would look nice too. Um, but yeah, these are, these are pink, these are torn and I love them. So yeah, um, I think that that's really cool. And yeah, I've been, I've been into jeans a lot lately too. And I have to show you my other coolest pair, which I have like a little outfit idea for that I'm doing maybe this Friday. Um, so yeah, let's see. Okay, so the whole reason that like I wanted to do this video was because I wanted to show these jeans. These are like crazy jeans. They've got like skulls on them. They're all torn. This has like roses on the tear. Um, and they've got all these cool like little like patches and like paintings on the butt they do too. There's one that says, where is it? It's like right here, it says making out is good for you, which isn't something that I really want to advertise, but you know, it is. Um, so yeah, that's not less necessarily a message that I'd like to convey, but I still think that these are really cool pants and nobody notices that. So yeah, I just think like, I like the skulls. I like the painted parts on the front more than like the patches and stuff. The patches are a little bit like, is a little bit like uncomfortable at times, but I think they're pretty cool and I love these. So I'm actually going to um, Emo Night Brooklyn on Friday. I think I'm going at least. Um, so I have these pants. Today is Friday, so yeah. Um, these pants are what I'm thinking of wearing and where's the top that I wanna wear? I'm either gonna wear like this top, maybe with these earrings, maybe with different earrings, but um, I was thinking of wearing this top that I also just hauled in my video yesterday. This is from a brand called Vocal that I just found this in like a small boutique and yeah it's got sparkly wings on the back so I think these two together would look super cute for that. Um, I don't know if I necessarily want to wear jeans for that but I still think it's super cute and um, I think that that would be like a good outfit for that or even just with like this top I think this is cute and those would look cute together and I like it. <laughs> okay I'm kind of jumping back and forth in between like outfits I am wearing or outfits that I'd like to wear in, during the season and things that I've just been wearing a lot recently and this is one of the things that I've been wearing a lot recently um you know spring gets very rainy and I usually wear glasses so I like to have this on my head like so that my glasses don't get wet when it rains and I just think that this is a really cute hat this is from American Eagle it's very springtime very flowery um I've been wearing it like when it's not really raining that hard out or I don't really need to wear it. I just, I feel like wearing it. I'm not really like a big like hat person, but I think I look pretty good in hats. So I like how this looks on me and I just think it's cute. Okay, so this is the outfit that I wore yesterday and it looked really like kind of summery actually, but I still think it would be, it's cute in the spring. Um, it's this shirt that I got a few years ago from American Eagle. It's just, let me show you because <laughs> the details got kind of kind of mixed in <laughs> thing right here and yeah it's just it's this it's a tank top it's a little bit long on the bottom which I kind of like and it's got like these fringes on it and I just 
I think it's really cute. I like it. And I wore it with um, these pants, actually. So these pants, um, I mentioned this yesterday again, but these definitely, like, when you talk about fashion that inspires you, like, these were just made by, like, a person in Brooklyn, and he only, he doesn't sell them online. He only sells them at, like, local craft fairs and things like that. So, um, yeah, this matches the bottom of this pretty well, because this is, like, a dip dyed. So I really liked how, like, that little bit of, like, the darker blue just went with the darker blue that's in most of this. So I really liked that outfit. I know I'm not, like, showing you guys the outfits, but, um, yeah, you can, you can kind of get the idea of, like, these two together kind of matching. My lighting's terrible. My arms aren't that long to, like, show you everything, but I just, I like that. I love, like, all the detail on these pants. Like, it's just so cool looking that it's, like, a little bit different everywhere you go. And these are, like, nice, flowy, super comfortable pants, too, so I like these. Okay, here's something that I haven't worn yet, but I think, like, it would be, like, a fun thing for the spring and summer. I've mentioned this skirt before. Um, I think I did a date night video, like, around Valentine's Day. Yeah, I talked about this skirt, and I think it's just so pretty. It's so nicely detailed. I got so many compliments when I wore this to my friend's bachelorette party. I also wore it to a Lady Gaga concert that I went to in August. And yeah, this would this would actually be nice with like the shirt that I have on now. And yeah, I think the details are cool. But the top that I think would go with it that I'm also just gonna wear like as a regular like top during the summer too, uh, with just like jeans or capris or I, I don't really wear shorts. I'll probably if it's not too hot, I'll still probably be wearing jeans in the summer. I don't know. <laughs> but this, this is like I got this from Old Navy. And it's just like it's super ruffly, which is pretty in right now. And it just it looks really nice and beachy and it looked nice on. And I thought that that with like the green detailing and the skirt and like the florals with the leaves, I thought that that would look really cool. And like, I want to have an occasion to wear this. And I just, I really want to wear this skirt as much as possible because it's so adorable. Um, this actually did come with like a crop top that matched it, but I don't do crop tops. So yeah, um, I really like it and I think it's cute. It might not have been a crop top. It might've been a regular dress, but, or a regular top, but I think it was a crop top and that's not my style. Um, like this super like ruffly thing that's the back with I'm trying to get you guys the full effect of this because I feel like I'm doing a bad job of that but I think these two together would be super cute so this is a skirt that I got from American Eagle and I don't I have a top to go with this but I don't know where it is right now um but yeah this is just it's nice it's like short in the front and long in the back um this like it did also have a matching crop top but I did not want to buy a crop top um yeah yeah this doesn't match this but um yeah so this is just like a nice little long skirt even though it's like cut off in the bottom so you know you need to shave if you're gonna use it but I just think this is really pretty I think I'm gonna wear this Friday night because I'm going somewhere kind of fancy uh, for dinner. But yeah, I know I said I was also going to emo night Brooklyn on Friday night, I might be doing both. So yeah, that's that's my whole like, I might be going there thing. So yeah, this is just really nice and ruffly and pretty and I like it and I want to wear it. <laughs> up are these pants, which I've talked about before. I just I love the flowiness of these. I actually wore them with a blue top like this. Again, I'm not quite sure where that top is. I think I saw it like somewhere. It's not in my drawers here though, so I can't like pull it out right this second, but I think it's nice because it matches that and it matches like this green color, so I could maybe wear that green shirt with it. I think that would look a little bit too like, you know, the patterns wouldn't necessarily go as well together as that green top does with that skirt. But yeah, I liked the blue color that I wore it with and I do actually have another green top that would go with it that I have right here. See, it's this, this top I got from American Eagle. I was just wearing um, a different version of that in my videos that I did yesterday, which I filmed today, but I changed my shirt because I got coffee on that and I'm doing a fashion video and I didn't want coffee on my shirt while I'm doing a fashion video. Um, but anyway, yeah, I just, I like how the green 
in both of these matches. I think that that looks really good and I like it. And then like I like like nice holographic things because um, when it gets like summer and you get the sun shining down on like this bag, this is ex absolutely gorgeous. So this is a coach bag. It's a little bit misshapen right now. Let me fix that <laughs> as much as I can. I have a gold bag from Coach 2 that's in a slightly different shape, but it's the same, like, metallic gold type of deal. And, um, yeah, I just, I love how holographic this is. I think um, Young, Wild, and Polish talked about this a few years ago, which is when I got it, like, around when she was talking about it. It's from the outlets. I just, I think it's so pretty. I don't think that they have this anymore at the outlets, but hopefully they have some sort of, like, metallic bag like this, because it's just... When you see it in the sun, it's just so pretty and so cool. So, I, and I get a lot of compliments on this one too. So I love this. I have to like use this in the summer. It's so nice. And then I have some other earrings, which it's going to be kind of tough to show you guys, but um, this is from Betsy Johnson. These I got last year because usually around springtime, I will cut my hair a lot shorter. I haven't done that yet, but I'll probably do that soon. So I wanted to get like cute little earrings to like make a statement when I do that because you know you have to have like cute earrings when you have short hair if you want to go for like that sort of I, I just think it looks cute together if you have short hair and you wear cute little earrings like this. Um, what I love about this kind I do have another one too I just wasn't showing them both. It's an ear jacket so like this is like the back of the this like little petal thing is the back of the earring. So if you just wanted to wear like the flower on its own and have like a little bit more of a simple design, you could. These are from Betsy Johnson and I got them last year. Um, but yeah, I think that that just looks so cool. Like, I don't know if you can see it. There, it's a little bit like holographic duochrome type looking. And I think those are cool um, together and it looks cool for the spring. Then I have this necklace, which is a little bit more summery. I actually wear this a lot in the fall because I actually won this in um, a gift auction. Um, so this is a nice little like beachy shell and there are some beads on it and it was handmade. It's so pretty and like it just like any plain outfit just looks so good with this on it. So like and it looks a little like I don't know the shape of it is like different too like I, I just like it and the clasp is I like this kind of clasp because that's really easy to do it doesn't really you know because the cage neck of this it's not like the best combination but I think that this is like really pretty on a nice like plain even like a white top or like a black top or something or like this blue color it would look pretty with and I just I like this a lot and I like the little sound it makes too. <laughs> So yeah, this is really special and I like it. Okay, so I hope you guys like this video. Please check out Lisa's channel if you haven't already. I can't wait to see what she's picking because I think we have similar like fashion senses, but I think we do like very different things with our fashions because she's like more professional than I am. So yeah, she like dresses professionally and stuff. Um, and yeah, um, so I just, I can't wait to see what she has. And um, I hope you guys like her video and you know, subscribe, uh, whatever. Um, thank you for checking out my video if you're from her channel, and I will see you guys all in my next video. Uh, bye.